Hello Networkers, we have released a new training course for configuring a typical and common Citrix SD-WAN solution step by step. There are many ways how a Citrix SD-WAN solution can be deployed, whether it is in line, behind a firewall, directly connected to a router or a firewall appliance, or if it is deployed directly into the different WAN clouds on your network. And there are other deployment factors with the WAN connections themselves whether they are set up with primary and secondary paths, or they are bundled together, treated as a single connection where traffic can be load balanced. For this training course, this is the Pacific SC-WAN topology that we will be setting up, which is the most common and the most popular deployment used in real world practical networks today. This network diagram picture shows what this typical deployment looks like and what we will set up in this course. Each site will have a Citrix SC-WAN appliance connected directly into each WAN cloud, which would be the internet and a private WAN like MPLS. We will configure a single virtual WAN where all WAN connections will be bundled together for traffic distribution across all WAN links, plus it will provide redundancy. Once we are done, we should have full connectivity between our headquarters and our branch office locations. And this right here reflects our finished and working configuration looking at the SC-WAN appliance at our headquarters location. You will see the virtual paths going to and from our different locations. So in this course, we will show you how to install and to set up the SC-WAN appliances. We will build the configuration and deploy it to our sites. I will also show you how to make changes to the existing configuration and deploying those updates, among other topics that you can view on our website. And you can get more information at routehub.net.